we're live. Hi, right. everybody. Hello, your favorite uh, USB camera line here. Uh, my name is Patrick Kirby with uh, Huddle Cam HD, and I'm here with Margaret Willman. Hi, everyone. Um, in the background, you can uh, also see our, uh, our other channel partner, Matt Richards, um, on the call. He is Hi, everyone. joining us. Thanks for joining. Joining us remotely. All right? Great. So, all right, guys, this is our Q1 2017 webinar. Um, so, welcome. Um, it is on YouTube, so um, we're looking at that chat. So, feel free to ask any questions in chat go along here, and then we'll have a QA at the end. Um, something that we're also doing today at the end is a giveaway. So, make sure you're, uh, you're listening and paying attention. Um, at the end in the chat, um, this should take about a half hour, and at the end in the chat we'll, we'll put a question in there. The first person that answers it correctly receives our giveaway, which is a Huddle Pot Air. So stay tuned for that question, um, you know, and hopefully we'll get you guys uh, communicating with the free Huddle Pot. Yeah, and just really quickly, I think you all know this, but our email for the partners team is partners at huddlecamhd.com right. um, and then orders for placing orders is orders at huddlecamhd.com so if you guys okay. have any questions related to uh, what we're up to or general general sales questions or technical questions feel free to e uh, email us at, at partners and then if you have any questions about your orders um, that will go directly to the orders team so right let's get started all right, so a quick agenda. We won't read through this whole agenda, but we have pretty much to cover here in a half hour. A lot of new product announcements, new uh, options, and new pricing for yep. 2017. Yep, we just want to get you guys caught up. Uh, you know, with some, some new products, um, you know, some new, what we're up to, uh, what you can expect to see, all that, all that good stuff. So. All right, yeah, so first of all, let's introduce the team. I'm Margaret Willman, Channel Development. Um, so again, feel free to contact me, give me a call, um, or partners at huddlecamhd.com or margaret.willman at huddlecamhd.com. Right, and my name is Patrick Kirby. Uh, I am one of, one of the partner managers, your account managers. I handle uh, a majority of the East Coast and, and some of our international partners. So if you want to set up uh, lunch and learns or, or, or uh, schedule, <laughs> schedule cameras, camera demos, um, you know, marketing calls, feel free to get in touch with me and we can uh, help help you um, get set up. Uh, I uh, have some a lot of experience working abroad as well as uh, I'm, I'm from Philadelphia. So I've been uh, in the East Coast for a long time. All right. Hey, Matt, you want to introduce yourself? Hey everyone, thanks for joining. My name is Matt Richards. Um, I'm actually located in Salt Lake City. So uh, I work with uh, all of our partners on the west side of the country. Um, so I'm looking forward to working with you all soon and I'm happy to answer questions and uh, and uh, work with you soon. All right, how's the, how's the snow out there, Matt? There's a lot of it right now. <laughs> so, so some good skiing for sure? That's right. All right. So, all right. On the support side, who we don't have with us today, uh, but I'm sure some of our partners have worked with him. Han Andy Chatfield is one of our lead tech support um, technicians. He, he's a great guy. He does um, testing, um, product compatibility, uh, ticket assistance, um, you know, phone support, all that stuff. So if you have any technical questions regarding, you know, possible, you know, working with the software, use cases, anything like that. Um, feel reach feel free to reach out to Andy. You can either submit a ticket and that you know that goes directly to him and the support team or there's also support at huddlecamhd.com. And we've added a new team member, Sean Regan. Maybe you've all already um, talked to him, but um, he is also available for support now. Um, so we have a team of people to help you out. Yep. Really nice guy, kind of goofy picture, but <laughs> no worries. <laughs> um, all right, so um, Matt, I think you're going to kick this off, correct? Yeah, absolutely. This is something uh, we're really excited about. Um, so here we have the uh, all-in-one Huddle Cam 3X, uh, and this is with a built-in dual microphone array. 
So I believe we have a quick introduction video. Um, are we going to cue that? Yep. Why don't we play the video for him? Something uh, we wanted to show you guys. So this has the same uh, format or same form factor as our current current Huddlecam 3X, except with a larger base to incorporate that uh, dual microphone array. This is going to be compatible with virtually any meeting software on the market. Um, using a USB 2.0 port, you're going to gain uh, audio, video, and control. Um, so this is a really exciting unit that we believe is going to be um, a great seller as this is an excellent all-in-one uh, camera and microphone unit. Here you'll see the uh, dual microphone array. This is going to be um, sufficient for any small to medium-sized room, and it's going to provide uh, audio pickup for all participants. Um, right. This has the same great quality as our current 3X, so pretty excited about this product. Yep, this, it, where this fits into the marketplace are for people that are looking for that audio and video all-in-one unit where, you know, they don't want to stretch some sort of microphones to the table. It's a smaller huddle room. Um, you know, they're trying to get audio and video through through Skype, WebEx, Google Hangouts. Um, this will all be handled over one USB 2.0 cable and, you know, takes care of, um, well, one installation helps make that simpler. Also, you know, you're not, um, you know, extending any mics to the table. Uh, quick things to keep in mind here is that this is will be a microphone only. So it's a, a dual microphone array. It'll pick up. Um, you know, microphone, beam forming microphones outward, out towards your conference room, stuff like that. Your, you know, 15 by 15 rooms. Uh, it's not a speaker. You would technically be using the speakers through the television uh, to get to get your your far end sound. So it doesn't completely take away from a, a speakerphone aspect, um, but it it will be a, a nice product that will have several use cases available for you guys. Yeah, and I don't know if you can all see that. Matt's um, window is there in front of the map pricing, but it's five ninety nine is map. Um, we have MSRP as well as map for you. Okay. Yep. You know, and feel free to contact us more about the product or pricing, whatever. So, right, uh, the Huddle Cam HD Simple Track. This is our new um, all-in-one tracking y tracking camera. It's a unique uh, tracking camera that will be. Um, USB follows on the huddle cam line. Auto tracking has been a, a very popular feature. Uh, a lot of requests um, for for these types of scenarios for lecture capture, um, auditoriums, uh, you know, other other type of auto tracking use cases. Um, TED talks. You know, you can have your own TED talk if you want. Something like that. Um, and once again, starting at map five five thousand four hundred ninety nine. And we got a quick video to go over that as well. All right, so there's the huddle cam, cam simple, simple track. There I am on video. Uh, <laughs> what a good looking guy, you know. Um, you know, but it shows you it's going to be compatible with virtually any software. So your your current um, video conferencing softwares or recording softwares, broadcast softwares. It's a two camera system. It's got the front uh, wide angle camera and the pan tilt zoom camera above with the 20x optical zoom and the 60 degree field of view for the pan tilt zoom. It comes with an easy IP control software so you can manage multiple cameras, set the camera settings, put them all in your network, right? You can kind of see quickly the wide angle camera, so for setting the tracking distance and then the pan tilt zoom actual tracking camera, right? And there's the camera lists. Once they're put on your network, they'll all pop up in that IP software. You can set the settings, advanced settings, set the blocking zones, the whole nine yards. Um, we will have more footage on on the uh, on the the IP interface but yep just showing it will become with uh, a convenient tripod kit or a ceiling mount option um, you know and that will be included in the price included in the, the product offering um, and it's easy extension cables once again lecture capture there I am in a, in a, in a classroom um, you know any any tracking solution that's been a popular request so we we wanted to develop something there for you guys and that should be available um, in Q1, hopefully sometime in February, for those that are wondering. All right, All right and we have a live, a live demo now. We're yeah. going to grab Paul here we have and a, uh, get him on camera, too. Yeah, we, we brought a, um, a male model in to, <laughs> in, in to uh, show, show some live tracking stuff. 
It's all, all right, relative. there's there's our <laughs> our male male model um, to show you the. Yeah, right. we have our uh, simple track on a tripod um, now tracking Paul walking around in our boardroom. So there he is. Um, you can also set presets uh, for this. You can set a home so it'll go back home if it loses tracking. Um, so we'll show you that menu here pretty quickly. That's showing him what writing on a whiteboard or an interactive board. You know, you can zoom in if you wanted to. You really want to um, alleviate the presenter from having to have any, you know, have to control anything. Yeah. But there are controls there um, if you wanted to to make changes. Well, and uh, the good point you bring up there, Margaret, is that uh, one, it it uh, it eliminates the need for um, an operator. Right. You know, and it also is IP based. Right. So you can manage that. Once, once you put it on the network, you manage that remotely. Right. Right. So, you know, one, one IT director that, that needs these in a, in a bunch of rooms, he can pretty much just go in and start that individual classroom. It'll pick up the professor, and then he can, you know, manage all that remotely. Right. You know, the camera settings, the, the starting and stopping of tracking, and the whole nine yards. It also has your manual pan, tilt, zoom options. Uh, they're there, you know, I guess if you wanted to. Uh, manually track it, you know, but there's the menu there that that we're uh, showing. Yes, this is the <coughs> You know the simple track software the advanced settings um, You know 1080p 60 you can set various resolutions you can set home positions you can set IP addresses you can um, pretty much set up all that um, You know it's set up the the tracking zone. That's where you can see Paul setting up the tracking zones so we'll you can block. There's blocking zones there. Yeah, so you could block out certain parts of the room if you didn't want it to go to the, those zones. All right. So that's Paul blocking out a door. So if somebody entered the classroom while it was uh, tracking or doing something, it would it would just block that out and not track that person. All right. And it is a mixture of uh, facial and and motion. Yeah. The primary tracking is motion tracking, and then uh, it has facial as well if there's movement in the background. Um, so yep. it's a mixture. Yep. And once again, you know, we're, we're releasing this right now. We've, we've been developing this. It should be available sometime in February is what we're hoping. So um, feel free to ask us more questions. We do have the, the partner's email there for you, you know, so feel free to, um, you know, shoot us an email and, you know, we can either ho help get you a, a demo unit for you to play around with or, uh, you know, we can always hop on a video call. Yep. And and auto track ourselves if you if you want. So right. So the new ceiling mount plate, another popular request. Um, we have had ceiling mounts before. We we've had various ceiling mounts um, you know, as well, just kind of different. Uh, this is the drop down it's the ceiling mount plate for the we've had the one inch pipe thread mount for uh, drop ceiling scenarios. This is the, the ceiling mount plate. Right, so you, that would you, go above the acoustic ceiling tile, yeah. making it kind of a kit, you know, so you're not up there above the drop ceiling trying to figure out what pe parts you need to install this. Well, and we yeah, we had this for a while. Um, we just, we offered the, the one inch pipe thread mount. We just haven't had the full solution, so we were kind of leaving people with, uh, well, you know, get your own pipe. Right. Now we got that for you. So if you have any questions about that, feel free to reach out. Um, all right, this is showing you our Q1 27 pricing. Yeah, right? just Available a reminder that we do have MSRP um, as well as MAP. On all of our sites, we list MSRP. So um, there is MAP pricing um, to really protect um, the channel and uh, increase your, your margins there. Yep. Um, yeah, the huddle can simple track turkey, right? All right. Yeah. The uh, once again, if you have any questions about pricing as well, after this after this webinar, we will be sending out all the Q1 2017 pricing. So uh, look look for an email from us in particular, either Matt, Margaret, or I, and um, we will be in touch. Um, yeah. And now we just want to go over. Our, our collaboration solutions. I think Margaret is going to um, address our, our kitted solutions and kind of 
tell you a little bit more about them and, and why we developed them the way they are and, and some of the, the solution the way we imagine it. So. Right, so there's a, a quick video showing this kit. There's the uh, mini PC, the camera, the camera wall mount, uh, the Acoustic Magic mic uh, array, um, as well as the meeting room interface. Um, this really works with any web conferencing software. Um, this is like a meeting dashboard that gives the user a really um, nice interface to start their meeting and share applications. There's the mini PC that's included um, and the mount for that PC, um, which would mount right behind the flat panel display in the room with Windows 10 pre-installed um, on there for you so you're ready to go or your customer's ready to go. Um, so, um, again, a nice kit that you can offer, um, really easy to install and, and use. Um, the SKUs are um, on the price list. There's a couple different SKUs. Um, there's the Team and then there's the Team Plus for like a bigger conference room. There's also a couple SKUs for uh, support for Exchange integration, okay? Yep. I uh, just so. want to recognize that some of the value add for our partners when they are, are looking at this kit is that it is customizable, right? Especially the, the uh, meeting room interface, right? So whether your clients have Skype for Business or Zoom or Google Hangouts or, or GoToMeeting or whatever, all that will work with that, um, with that meeting interface, which is nice. And once again, there are two, two, main, two main ones. And we'll show you how to set it up. Here's a quick installation video. Um, you know, kind of chop down, showing you a quick uh, Nook, Nook install, one of our installers. Um, That's um, actually showing the mount, um, the display mount. That is not included, um, so your customer would have to um, add a display, a flat panel display and display mount um, over and above the kit that you're providing. Yep, and, and the, real, the real question here is that everyone's getting out, you know, Everyone's getting out of the TV business. There's no money in them. You know, there's no point for us to try and ship them internationally either. Uh, and a lot of times, cl your clients are already going to have a display in a meeting room that they just use for a TV. This gives you the kit that you can, you know, offer them. And this, it's, it's a full solution, easy to install, easy for your, their IT departments to, to support. So you know just just provide your own own display and mount and then our kit will fit virtually any any display that that you that you have right now this is showing the customization of that meeting room interface or dashboard so you can add your logo there your customers logo change the color scheme um, add the icons for the conferencing software so they can quickly launch skype or zoom when they walk into the room you can lock down the pc so the user is not doing all kinds of different things on that uh, mini pc that's dedicated to the room you can reset the room um, you can also add icons for any applications that are being shared common, you know, that are popular applications that you're using for web conferencing. Um, it also gives you camera control. Um, right now here we're showing this video how you can customize it for your customer um, or your, you know, have your logo. Um, but you can also um, have camera control right there to, re to, to zoom, pan, tilt right camera from control, the interface. Yeah. So everything the user would need, need to, uh, to quickly launch a web conferencing meeting um, and uh, reset the room when they're finished. Yeah, with various softwares, right? Yep. That's the nice part is that it helps get you out of that proprietary arena. You're not dealing with these you know, super expensive codecs that you have to use all that equipment. Once again, these, a lot of your clients already have these solutions. They're already a Skype house, they're already a GoToMeeting house, they're already a WebEx house. This gives you a solution that you can offer those, your clients regardless of what they're using and allows you to you know, support some of that hardware. Um, so it's, and it's not just, not just conferencing, right? right? So you can put Office 365, you know, Microsoft Word, they can open up Excel 
and importantly, they can lock it out. Right. Right. So you can make it so for the IT department can pretty much just put uh, you know Office on there mm -hmm. along with your video conferencing software, and you lock it lock down the PC so they can only access that. Right. For end users, that makes it super easy because they just go in and open what they need, and there's a, a room reset button. So at the end, at the end of the, the conference or the, the meeting, even if it's local and they don't use the video conferencing, right? They're just using Word or whatever, right? You know, they, you lock it out, and when they leave, there's a, a, a room reset button, and it, it starts it all over pretty much, and and you know wipes the the usage record and all that. So um, I think Matt was going to address the camera control, the new c camera control options we have. So why don't, why don't we let him? Uh, go over some of our control options. That's right. I'll, uh, I'll dive right into that. So if you're not going to use our, our amazing brand new uh, auto tracking camera, we have a couple different options here. Um, so every uh, Huddle Cam HD camera comes with a handheld IR remote. Um, we do sell replacement remotes. Um, we have the SKU uh, right there on the slide. Um, as well as that, we have the RS-232 joystick, which you're seeing in this quick introduction video. Um, this can control quite a, a whole number of cameras. Um, the first four cameras you can control using the select buttons. Really nice uh, user-friendly joystick there that's going to allow you to do pan, tilt, uh, zoom. Um, along with that, you have buttons for uh, focus. Um, you actually have a, a, a keyboard buttons for zoom, um, iris. Um, and this joystick is great for setting presets. Um, you can do... Um, up to 256 presets. So this is going to be really nice for using multiple cameras um, in a lot of different scenarios. So um, you, you'll see map pricing there as well as the SKU right underneath um, that picture. Uh, along with the um, hardware controller, we have software options. These are available for um, PC as well as um, mobile devices, including a tablet or a smartphone. Um, and you will see all of the um, SKUs and pricing right there on that slide. Yep. And the nice thing to mention about the uh, the software options is that they're they are pretty intuitive and, and in depth. There's a lot of features mm -hmm. that come with them. Um, you know, stuff that you know a lot of people. I don't know if your end users would use, but for your you know your your live streaming uh, aficionados, your broadcast people, um, there's a, there's touring. There's like you know timed panning like mm. you can set up times for the for the presets there's a lot of interesting features in the in, in the software option um but the yeah pretty much the the huddle the rs232 uh, joystick controller is just um we gen it kind of made it a little bit more intuitive uh so that that's available for you guys as well all right all right and here's just a quick uh i'm in the way <laughs> you, can see, you can see the joystick behind me. It's just a uh, a quick uh, wiring diagram to to show how how to set up the cameras. Um, you know, with the DB9 extender and then the daisy chain cables, right? So that's one thing we just try and make sure people are aware of. You want the DB9 extension to the first camera, and then you're going to get uh, eight pin mini DIN RS232 cascade cables for every camera after that. So just keep in mind that first camera, and then cameras two to three to four to five to a million are all. Are all yep. two two. And we That's do good. have a lot of uh, cabling SKUs, just yeah. so you all know. Um, you can sell the, the cabling as well. All right. And here we got our Opti registration. All right. And that stands so. for Opportunity. Hopefully that's, <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's self-explanatory. Self but feel free to, if you guys have a larger deal, get it submitted so we can help help secure that for you um, you know that's pretty pretty standard I mean right the minimum registration is 10k um, it's valid if it's approved it's valid for 90 days um, and when you fill out the form you're asked to request a distributor so just um, be prepared to select a distributor when you fill out that form yep and we have had you know several several partners uh, do this with us um, as well and it, I think it's worked out pretty well. So let us support you guys uh, on your opportunities. Let's help you out. Let us help you get these things. So um, I 
think everything with that is good. All right, marketing campaign in a box. So if you need any help with marketing, um, let us know. Um, everything is here on uh, at this uh, site. Um, it's actually a Dropbox um, account. Yeah. And all our product images are there, email campaign templates. Um, logos. Um. Yep, these are just here so we can help you guys in your marketing efforts. Um, you know, we can help get you know uh, product brochures with, with your your company information on it. There's logos for for your website, so if you're putting them up on your websites or your e-commerce sites, um, you know, there's pictures, descriptions, um, important websites, um, and we update that more than quarterly probably uh every every two or three weeks or so yep. where, where anything new comes out you know it should should get put in there um so that's there for you feel free if you guys haven't gotten that already let us know and, and we'll make sure that gets to you um all right anything else we need to Nope, that's marketing campaign in a box. Um, the knowledge base, so frequently asked questions. Um, this is really managed by support. Um, so, um, you know, you can always access that if, if you feel as though um, you want to submit a ticket or submit a question or um, refer to questions that, that uh, customers have already asked. Um, that would all be there in the knowledge base. Yeah, and it's actually super useful. Um, you know, we there's so many videos up on the and Andy and Sean do a great job of making sure those videos are there you know so we're, we're Eastern Eastern Standard Time and I know some of our West Coast partners or some of our partners in Europe can't always get us on the phone um, that's a great place to start not only uh, are there are there questions there but uh, chances are there's a video going over it as well so and you can submit a new ticket it's right there so <laughs> All right, Matt, you want to uh, go over these uh, Udemy courses for Ud Udemy, U Udemy? Sure. <laughs> I, think, I think we're saying Udemy. No, Udemy. Udemy, okay. Uh, wow. This is, yeah, this is a fantastic resource for not only our partners, um, but for um, their end users and their customers. Um, this has just about everything they're going to need to get up and running, um, starting uh, live streaming systems and um, just basic uh, camera information. So you'll see Paul's going through this whole website. Um, this has everything um, that you could uh, possibly need to get up and running for uh, basic camera uh, control and uh, live streaming options. And we do have, uh, I think there's, uh, you have to pay for the, the course, but we have coupons available for you and you could uh, send those coupons to your customers. Yep. So if you have a customer looking at um, looking at one of our cameras, let them know that this training course comes along with it, right? So if you need some, some you know, extra, you know, grease for the wheel, let, let them know that these, these courses, you know, pretty much come with the camera for the most part and that, you know, it has live streaming, video conferencing, it goes over the cameras, goes over the control. So it's, it is it is a really nice resource that we tried to make available for, for not only our partners, but for our partners, customers, and clients. All right, so this is Woo, giveaway time. Giveaway. Woo! Do yeah. we have some bells or something? <laughs> <laughs> you know, got to get some sound effects for this next time. Okay, now this we are not going to read the question. Um, it is going to be um, posted in the YouTube chat. So make sure you have access to YouTube chat. Um, She's not going to put it up yet, but Tess is going to type it into YouTube chat in uh, you know a few seconds. Just want to make sure you all have access to YouTube chat before we put it in there. Um, and again, it's a Puddle Pot Air, which is our wireless USB um, conference phone, um, which is one of our most popular items. Yeah, these things so. are great. I mean, you know, wireless, super easy to use. Uh, it makes it super easy for end users and once again we we use it in our room this is a 20 by 20 room we've had easily 10 10 to 12 people in our rooms uh, and, and we use these things it, they're they're great okay I just let Tess know to go ahead and type the question there she goes it's in there 
So I guess now that it's in the chat, we can read it. Yeah. Um, so name all optical zoom lenses that HuddleCam HD offers. All right. So there's in one, a, chat in one string. In one string. Right. Oh, so there's a. Three X to 30X. Are you oh, we at? need to see all of them. We need I to see. Uh, <laughs> that's a good answer. We need to see. I think there's. Three there's to thirty. Four that we would accept. There's there four. could there's be five. Four. There's two more, Diego. Oh, did we get it? There we go. One, two, three, Wait, four, five. 12, 12 no, no, that's incorrect. No, no, that's not right. That's not right. Twelve. <laughs> there is no twelve. No twelve. Somebody's got to get it. One, two, three. Yeah. Okay. Sergio, come on, Sergio, you're come back, close. you're almost there. <laughs> we should have the Jeopardy music going. Oh, we should, do, yeah. we, have, do we have Jeopardy music available? Is that copyrighted? How does this work? Na, 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 na. Sergio. <laughs> so close. No, there's not a 12x. Come on. Yep. Oh, well, Sean. No, don't, no, Sean. <laughs> you can't win. You're an employee. <laughs> there we go. I think I think that's it. Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, everybody's got it. Right. Yep. I think, yeah. You got I the first, that, first correct answer. Alexander Pelequeen. Good job. You Good have a nice hot air. Thanks, everybody. We'll uh, see you next time. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> See you next year. <laughs> oh, Sergio finally put it in there. But he wasn't first. Man. I mean, it's tough. He's, I, I wish I could give They're it all They're behind away. us, too. Right? I wish I could so. give it all, of, all away for free. Question said huddle. Can we still be heard? Or did you mute us? Can you mute us? <laughs>